Sketches of two men appear on those wanted posters. Both appear to be in their 20s, and police believe those men are responsible for that terrible attack last weekend. News Channel 3 senior reporter John Palminteri joins us live from Mila Vista. And John, now police are just hoping that somebody can identify these guys. The UC Santa Barbara Police Department and the Isla Vista Foot Patrol are in the lead on this, and they're hoping as many people as possible will be taking a close look at this flyer and try and identify the suspects who are responsible for that brutal attack on the 19-year-old. She was not only assaulted, but then hospitalized on Sunday morning. Now, we have talked to many students out here who are aware of this attack and are taking a very close look at this flyer. Students are taking a close-up look at a wanted-style flyer now posted throughout the college town of Isla Vista at the nearby UC Santa Barbara campus. Police have released sketches of two possible suspects in an intensive sexual assault investigation. Last Sunday morning, a 19-year-old female victim said she was pushed to the ground, beaten, and sexually assaulted by a group she described as Asian men. Two Asian males are depicted in the flyer. They're said to be in their 20s. Oh, it's our safety. It really is, and I'm glad that they take that really seriously here. Students received an urgent email after the crime, then follow-up information, and now these flyers are on the doors of campus buildings and businesses nearby in Isla Vista. Earlier this week, the search and rescue team found evidence of the crime scene, along with items belonging to the victim and a possible suspect. Students who have seen these flyers say they're not only encouraged by the police response, they're making sure women are not walking alone in this area. Just like girls in this community, I feel like are always so vulnerable at night walking home alone by themselves, especially after partying or something like that. So if I see somebody is too drunk, you know, I make sure, you know, they have a safe way home. If she's too drunk, you know, I make sure she stops drinking. You know, if I know her or not, you know, I just care, you know. One woman who has some self-defense training says she is still on guard at all times. Yeah, and for sure, I mean, it makes you feel like more empowered at the moment, right? But I think if something was really happening, you might not come into play, you know? The campus does offer a free escort service for students who are out alone to get them home safely. And campus and community leaders are hoping that everyone in this area gets a close-up look at this flyer, hoping that they can possibly get some leads going that will lead to an arrest. In Isla Vista, John Palmentary, News Channel 3.